the rich boomers in this country won't do anything about this tyrannical power grab that we're facing here. They won't do anything about it, guys. They are not our forefathers, okay? Our forefathers had principles. They're men of character, men of honor, and men of action. The rich boomers in this country are petty, selfish, cowardly men. That's what they are. They're not going to do anything, guys. Rich boomers won't do anything. I mean, they've already lived their whole life in freedom. They've already made all their money, so they got all the free time and funds in the world. But they're not interested in lifting a finger to preserve the, the birthright that their forefathers literally gave up everything for. I mean, our forefathers gave up their estates. They risked their lives. Many of them were hung and killed. They gave up their lives, guys. And these rich boomers don't want something bad to be said about them on next door or in a, a, a tweet. It's utterly pathetic. It truly is pathetic. And it's not going to be them that does it. It's going to be our generation that does it. It's going to be the 20 to 40s. Okay? We're the men of action. Um, and it's probably not going to be the rich. Which means we're not going to have a lot of funds on our side. But what do we have, guys? What do we have on our side? We have heart. We have heart. We have principles. And um, and we have a value system that, that understands and honors our forefathers. Now, things are probably going to get a little rocky, but... If we organize, if we meet others that are like-minded and focus local, guys, that's a big part of the key. The powers that be want us to focus on federal politics. Pfft. You're not going to do shit about federal politics. They want us to focus on state politics. You're probably not going to do shit about state politics either, especially if you're in a big state. It's local, guys. City council, county supervisors, and mayor, chief police chief that's where the play happens okay that's where the shift happens now we've got the Mises caucus the libertarian party they are a great organization and they're doing damage in these areas and um, we've got other organizations that are popping up ready to really get something rolling. We've got men of action. We've got leaders standing up in our communities, standing up against school boards. Um, we've got people that are planning coups on how they're going to take over the school boards, how they're going to take over the planning departments, how they're going to take over the, the city councils. And that is all great, guys. That is all great. That's what we need. It's going to take a little bit of time, but if you're interested in these types of things, join an organization, guys. Join the Proud Boys. Join the Libertarian Party. Join any other organizations who are going to actually do something and stand up to this nonsense and stand on principles. Don't join the Republican Party, guys. Cowardly they are. Cowardly they are. They're cowardly, backstabbing pieces of shit. That's what the Republican Party is. Yeah, no, it's not all of them. It's just 99% of them. And and they're they're compromisers, guys. They're knee-bending compromisers. That's all you have with the Republican Party. Don't give them a dime. They don't deserve it. What have they done? What have they done? They deserve nothing from you guys. They've ruined this country. Get local. Get local, get organized. Take over these political institutions. That's the path forward. But you're not going to do it unless you start meeting with like-minded men and you guys start planning. Once men of means get together and build bonds, then these things can be established. But until you start meeting with like-minded men, it's not going to happen. That's why the Proud Boys is a great organization, guys. Find your local Proud Boys chapter. 
So is the Mises Caucus and the Libertarian Party. Um, you've got the Bears. Owen Benjamin started uh, Bertaria. The Bears, that's an outstanding group of men and women right there. I mean, look, guys, you, I'm sure you've got tons of stuff like this in your area. I'd, I'd, I'd start building, start meeting people, and um, that's, that's the path forward. It's the only path forward. Let me know what you think. Like, subscribe, share, comment, and um, check out my stuff on Gab, too, um, because that's where I'll be posting most content in the future. Thanks for listening, guys. Thanks for giving me a couple minutes out of your day. And I hope you are having a positive attitude, and I hope you have a great week. Peace.